Yo, I don't ever go live, y'all. But for my son, I will. Let me show y'all something. You see this house right here? Y'all see this shit? Last night, these racist motherfuckers called my son and his friends all type of niggas. Okay? Nigga this, nigga that. My son 13. Out of all of that, they chased my son. Chased him. I had my son in the fucking bushes running for his fucking life. But what they don't know is they got the right fucking mother. Called my son all type of niggas. Guess what? The nigga's mother's here and these bitches won't answer the door. We are Main Street in Manchester. You see this? When y'all see this house right here, get disrespectful. They racist. My son was going with his friend to get diapers. And this motherfucking white trailer trash truck and whoever lives here chased my son down while calling him niggers. My son was in a bush calling the fucking police because he was scared. So you know me? I pulled the fuck up. These niggas won't come outside. For my kid, I will fuck up the world. Called my son niggas, yo. Chased my son down the street. And now they won't open the door. This house right here. Called my son a fucking nigga and all his friends. And then they got in the truck and chased my son and his friends down the street while yelling racial slurs. My son 13. He shouldn't have to go through that. Yo, Facebook. Y'all know I'm here acting up, right? Not my son. Not my fucking son. Now they won't come outside. Look, niggas peeking and shit. But chased my son down in his raggedy ass truck. You see him and his friends? Chased him down the street in that truck while calling them all type of niggas. Had my son hiding in a fucking bush. Racism's real, I suppose, right? Girl, the cops came last night and these motherfuckers wouldn't open the door. I just got wind of it this morning. So a bitch out here in her sneakers ready for whatever over fucking mine. Y'all fucking crazy. Y'all don't even know. I'll burn this fucking house down over mine. Y'all don't even know what y'all just started, what y'all just got yourself into. This ain't going to end till y'all just cut. Not my fucking son. Nah, bitches, you got me fucked up. Chased my son down the fucking street, y'all. Had my son in the fucking bushes, hiding, calling the police because he ain't know what to do. My fucking son, black sons, you know, you wouldn't think that this shit would happen. He tried to go to the store and on his way past this house, these motherfuckers called him, you little nigga, nigga this, nigga that. My son ain't never been exposed to that. Let's get trucks. You see that? This raggedy shit. Hi. How are you? Did you know your neighbors were racist? Kinda. They chased my fucking son down the street, calling him all type of niggas. Okay, my son 13. They chased him in the fucking truck and tried to run him over. That's sad as fuck, right? In the world we got today. Now they won't come outside. You chased a group of 13 year olds and called them niggas? Now the niggas mother's here. The crazy nigga bitch. And my son was, he was on his way. He was on his way to go get diapers for a friend with his friends and I guess they were walking by that house that I showed you guys and there was some white guys they were drinking in their yard and I guess my son and his friends were walking by and they 
as they were walking by, these two white guys decided to call them all type of niggas. Little nigga this, nigga that, nigga that. And my son and his friends, they were so shocked that it was happening. That they, they kind of just stood there. Because, I mean, why would our kids be worried about the color of their skin, right? I'm sorry, I have no voice. I just came from the house acting crazy. I look crazy. Please excuse me. If you know me, you know this not my regular look. But anyway, the guys decided that they wanted to chase my son down and three of his friends. They're all black. Him and his brother got in the car, proceeded to chase my son down the street. There's footage. Chase my son down the street. My son and his friends were pedaling so fast. They eventually had to jump off their bikes and hide in some fucking bushes. All right, but listen to this fly shit. Because now that I'm calm, I got the whole story. Yo, these motherfuckers got out their truck. Chased my fucking son. Almost caught him by his hoodie. So my thing is, what was you going to do to my kid when you got a hold of him? But if you know Nas, you know Nas quick on his motherfucking feet. So he ain't catch my son. These motherfuckers took my son's bike. Two grown ass men. Grown men. Okay. They took my son's bike. They had my son hiding in some fucking bushes. Scared of his fucking life. Yo. I'm motherfucking livid. Y'all see my face? I want to fuck some shit up over my kid. I don't play that. All right. I don't play that. But what my... What I'm so upset about is I'm sitting home right now waiting for a call to tell me what the fuck is going to happen. My son almost died last night. These motherfuckers was trying to run over these children, okay? And I'm sitting here waiting for something to possibly happen. Yo, this shit is not okay. I think some of us, we, we know what's going on. We we kind of like put it right here, but when you're actually going through it, yo, it's different. I almost lost my son over some racist shit last night. You guys, I'm upset. I'm hurt. I don't know what to do. Y'all know me. I'm fucking crazy. Three black boys chased by two grown ass men. They weren't doing anything. They were going to get diapers for somebody fucking else. And now here I am home just trying to figure out what I'm going to do next because I don't know. Because I'm crazy. I just want to fuck some shit up. But I know that that's not the right thing to do. I know that I have to be smart about this. I need help. I need people to know that this happened. I, this is serious. These The neighbors are saying that these these people are racist. I mean, yo, they're like chase you down the street racist. They're like Trump supporter racist. They're like fuck black people racist. Like, it's crazy. So, I just wanted to give y'all, you know, what happened. I'm very upset. I'm very worried. I don't know. I can't shelter my son. <coughs> Chased my son down. Almost grabbed him by his hoodie. Yo, you were so mad that you jumped. Yo, my son said that the guy jumped out of a moving truck. I promise you I will call you back. This guy was so mad at these children for whatever reason, he jumped out of a moving truck and fell out of the truck. When he fell out of the truck, he got up and picked up my son's bike. My dude, what can children do to make you that upset? Yo, I'm not feeling it. And I need help. I need to figure out what to do. I need, I need people to know this happened. I don't want this to happen to nobody else. Because you know what? I could have got a call last night that said that my son and his two black friends were brutally ran down because that's literally what basically almost happened. They had to hide in the fucking bushes. Could you imagine knowing that your child was hiding in the bushes scared for his life? 